allow me to put it plainly, it actually doesn't really matter what the history of Israel and Palestine is. It actually doesn't. I want you to learn to understand that now is now and reality is reality. A lot of people are trying to figure out how did we get here? How did the Israelites and the Palestinians end up at center stage of a literary of blood shedding? I am going to help you understand only what matters today. Here we go. Now, pay attention and pay attention well. You may be fighting with somebody for a long time. Somebody may be fighting with you. But what took place is somewhere in this fight, somewhere in the triggering of energies, efforts, and ambitions, there is a country called Palestine. Doesn't matter how big it is. Doesn't matter who Hamas is. But this country believed it could now start a fight with a bigger boy. This is a lesson to everybody. Do not ever go to war with somebody who has more money than you. It's kind of the moral of the story. What Palestine has done is they have decided to start a war with somebody who has more money than them. Now here's the thing. When a fight begins, what happens? Those who say I am with you are going to come and collaborate with you, right? So those who say I am with Israel have all marched together and said we stand with Israel. And unfortunately, it's the richest and most powerful. Now, there is also those who have come and said we stand with Palestine. Which is all the guys who feel bullied by the big boys. It doesn't matter. What is going to take place over the next couple of days and weeks is going to be remembered for years. I'm talking about decades. In fact, there is going to be history lessons, military lessons on how you do not start a fight with somebody who has more money than you. Palestine is going to be littered with a literary of blood. They are going to get their asses whooped. I'm talking about getting fucked up. I'm talking about I'm talking about Palestinians are going to get fucked up for real. What they did is no match. No match for what is about to happen to them. They will never ever forget the day they started it with the Israelites. Anybody out there who wants to learn about history, anybody out there who wants to learn about conflict, anybody out there who wants to learn about war, listen, the Mossad is now small boys. Yeah, they let you win. Maybe they even want you to get in. But when you make the foolish mistake of going into war, my God, the granddada, granddada of the big boys, you are going to get your ass whooped. So Palestine, hear me and hear me good. They're going to fuck you up. They're going to fuck you up so bad. My God, they're going to fuck you up. And Donald Trump is going to be president again. You have just fucking delivered Donald Trump another presidency. You are going to regret this. I hope you know that. And what a pity. Because you brought your kids into it and they had nothing to do with this. But that's it. The history of Palestine and Israel is insignificant. What is significant is war is war and war is right now. And my God. They're about to get fucked up.